this is another journey to find some shoes. Went to Running Room in Markham. This store actually doesn't have anything more than a 13 in any single size. So to make it worth my while, I did get all black slides. The frustration that has, it has been for me trying to find some 14s. Kudos to Sports Check for having a pair of 14s because if it wasn't for them, I'd actually have no fucking shoes. And yes, I've already put them on. Yo, this thin sock, bro, is showing the fucking, the grizzly claws, bro. I went back to the old road. That is fucking huge. Too much of anything. The more you have, the more you're conflicted. So this I typically use. I've given up. I just use it during the day or when I'm doing something in my car as a backup because if I want to vlog with my phone, Sony's EV one I don't really use. And then I also keep this mic just in case. I keep the DJI wire. But I'm going to go back to using this because I don't think I, I gave this a fair shot. It is big, but you got to just be okay with the fact that it's, it's a little beefy. But it's still, to me, in my opinion, Gives you some of the best audio. I actually gotta get some more. I don't have too much left. I gotta, I gotta get a little more. This is another journey. Let's see if we can actually find some 14. So I have a couple places in mind I want to check. Vaughn Mills was recommended to me. So we'll see if Vaughn Mills potentially has anything. But I will share with you guys that I am very, very frustrated. I didn't do Starbucks today. I regret it already. So it turns out Sivu Play, they do have some 14s, but they don't have, they have like Merrells, which are a type of shoe I bought my brother. He said they're comfortable. I want to try to get some Nike, so we're going to go to Von Mills. Wish me luck. So today was a pretty successful day. I was able to get three pairs of shoes. I got shorts and I got the ugliest socks. Buddy, look at all the goodies. Look at these. Look at those. I don't know about this color. That's a little interesting, but that. Oh, buddy. Those are fresh. I love that label on the back. Look at that. This is not the best way to show, but this is what actually caught my eye. That right there, that little threading. Mm -hmm. Green on green. And look at that. Sneaker heaven. Let me see my sweatshirt. But look at that. Look at that size I had to look for. I finally found it. A 14. All three. I don't know the gentleman's name at Running Room in Markham. Thank you, sir. He pointed me in the absolute right direction. You gonna see the new footwear? He just sneaks, bro. <laughs> I am so happy that I found size 14s. I think it's time to retire the fucking sweaters, man. Right. You got everything? Good morning. Happy Sunday. Happy Mother's Day. For any of you guys that have been longtime watchers, I hate driving with new shoes because it's an adjustment for me. So these shoes today that I have on, which are like Nike Air, I used to have these years ago. Not a fan. But because I'm limited with my selection, uh, now having to wear a 14, you gotta take what you can get. And these puppies, they ain't so bad. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Gave them their flowers and their gift cards. Hopefully they liked it. Shoes I'm wearing today, least comfortable out of the three. So I finally finished my project, my video, my vlog, and now DaVinci is giving me exporting issues. And I can't actually figure it out, which is bothering me just a tad more. It took me like 12 days to finish this video, not because it's some 
super fancy intricate project it's just everyday life some days i can edit for 10 minutes some days i can edit for two hours and then i kept like getting halfway and deleting the project i'm not sure why i think when i looked at the footage i just had too much of the same shit from just like different days so i was like okay well i have to change this i will be frank with you guys i just lost my patience i deleted the application and i'm like i'm back to final cut I never had these kind of issues with Final Cut. Never, ever, ever. And I'll be frank, I just don't have the patience for that. That's just too much. I literally spent the last day, all of yesterday almost, while doing other things around the house, editing this video. And now I literally have to re-upload Final Cut, go back to scratch, and edit all over again.